everybody, Yimbo here. Welcome to my page, Yimbo Reviews Everything. And I do have a quick review coming up for you. Um, today, we're going to be going over the Ecto-1 from Ghostbusters. The one that I guess was supposed to come out last summer and now will one day come out. Um, I don't have any figures for it, but let's see what's going on with this car. So let's get into this bad boy, will we? All right. Um, I'm a huge Ghostbusters mark. I just... I love the Ghostbusters. I have uh, my little Lego guys over here with my Lego Ecto-1. Um, I did skip out on the Plasma series, which I regret, but that's okay, because there's going to be a whole new line of toys for me to, to get into. So here we go. Unboxing the Ecto-1. This is a Target exclusive. Um, they appeared to be very hard to find early on, but um, it was one of the few things that they had plenty of at my local. So here we go, you only get one chance to capture your first impression. So this is it, man. Oh. All right, so what do we have here? Just a little some nonsense, some legal nonsense. Oh, this is very cool. This is very cool. All right, so here's what you get right away off the bat when you pull it out. There's the top here, so that looks like a little bit of assembly to, to do, but that's no big deal. I'm just gonna record this whole, this whole process and uh, I will make lots of edits. <laughs> All right. Man, oh man, where to even begin? So my wife had teased me about not knowing how these like things work. The little, <laughs> like just these, I don't know. What do you even call those? But she teased me about it. But this is this is getting better. This this is so far so good. I'm annoyed because I know I'm gonna have to stop recording in a second to go get scissors. What a bummer. Okay. So obviously this is one that I'm. This is for me and my kids. So, but me first. So we got a little bag of parts over here. There's a lot of all the little accessory type stuff. That's over there. Oh, I must have popped one of the rubber bands. That's okay. That's okay. Yeah. I'm tapping out for scissors. I'm tapping out for scissors. Back in. Okay, scissors, definitely required because, and here's another look at that. That's a lot of rubber bands to cut. They're everywhere, lots of them. So, bam, bam, all right, there's the top. All right, cut, snip, we got some movement. car so that's it that's everything that comes in the box this is what you're looking at now so this is it this is what comes in the box there is one more little these clear rubber bands that wrap around okay sweet all right now before I even put any of this together this is so cool this is so cool. Um, it's got a really nice weight to it. It's well made. This is well made. Look at the details on this. Like, you know, because again, this has been a car that's, I guess, in a barn or something for 30 years, right? Something along those lines. Look at that detail. And again, I'm sure you guys have seen. Um, oh, yeah. I've seen images and maybe even other videos online, but I appreciate you checking out this here. But man, I mean, that's that's very cool. But again, really nice, like heft and weight to it. Oh, that's great. Okay, so here we go. Um, easy. And 
let's crack this open. Now, the interesting thing is, because there are there are zero directions, um, how to know where these things go? I should probably look at the box again. I'm sure I'm missing something. One of these rush job unboxings that I do. Yimbo. Nothing but that piece of paper. Okay, so I'm gonna have this over here. So you can see, so this camera can catch this. All right, so let's see, how is this bad boy supposed to look? I'm doing a little bit of pulling and it's not popping back out so that's good but there's no like big snap Hmm. Okay, it's on this guy. There it is. There's the missing port. Antenna goes over here. Whatever this thing was gonna be. Ah, uh, good. Okay. Yeah. So that pops in. Come on, baby. Okay. And that goes into there. And apparently this is going to play a role in the new movie whenever <laughs> we do get to watch it. Like a drone, look at that. It's, it's like an RC car trap. Sick. That's really cool. Now, here we go for the rest of the impressions. So, got the box out of here. Here we go. It's smooth. It's smooth. It's not. It's a nice ride. That's a nice ride. That's neat. Okay. Uh, the door opens from the side, and it's got. I believe this is where the drone will go. Oh yeah. Not drone. RC car. RC trap. Do do do. Okay. Yeah. That goes in there. There we go. Bam, okay. And if you hear my begins in the background, my wife is with them. This is just YouTubers, content creators, <laughs> working parents. All right, guys, so there. Bam, that's a nice size, thick door. So that opens. Um, oh yeah, that's very cool. Okay, so that opens out here. It has the door, oh, the chair. That appears to want to swivel out. Me, oh, there it goes. Oh, that's sick. Look at that. But the coolest thing is on the back. So we're clearly, here I'll close that. We're clearly gonna get some really cool, um, ghost busting out of the side of the Ecto, which is awesome. So that's very cool. So both doors open there. Okay, now this one on the back does not open up, um, but we do have the driver's side door. I mean, all right, impressions. This is a really, for $50, I feel like this is a $50 toy. This, 
is very smooth. There's so many, like, I mean, you saw me put this together. It wasn't any big deal, but just a, so much detail and love, perhaps. <laughs> love of money, at least. But love went into this, for sure. Um, whoever designed this clearly has a love of Ghostbusters. And that's really cool. Um, to show you, oh, look at that. Did that door? Oh! So the even the door kind of has some interesting movement over here. It does actually intentionally kind of like work itself out a little bit. Let's see, there's like a little, yeah, just a little extension when it opens. All right, so for fun, to close things out, um, I wanted to just compare it to, this is mine. I played with this guy Countless hours, as I say, about most of the toys that I show off on this page. Um, but here is the side-by-side -side comparison. As you can see, um, my original, this is the real Ghostbusters Ecto-1, um, is larger. And that's because, from what I learned in my internet just research, um, there will be Ghostbusters for the new Ecto-1. There is going to be that line. There are going to be three and 75, three... 3.75 figure, so Star Wars sized. All right, so he will, you know, like he could fit in there. Um, actually, let's try it out real quick, right? See how it goes. Um, and while I'm setting him up, and again, these are things I'm sure most of you already know, but um, yeah, the 3.75 are going to be these new Ghostbusters line. Does it have straps? No. So he will like the person, the guy would just sit there. But yeah, that's the size. The real Ghostbusters, on the other hand, were five-inch figures. Um, I left them downstairs because my kids play with them. <laughs> um, but they were five-inch, and I bought the whole like re-release set, um, and they're awesome. And I want to like crack those open, but they're not going to fit in here. They will fit in here. <laughs> But as of right now, I've been letting my kids play with this. My son loves this car. Um, they'll push it around going, wee -oo, wee -oo. I'm missing the door, which I'm just going to throw out there. It's so hard to find. Like, you kind of assume that like anybody, you could find anything on eBay. And I know it has existed, but since I started looking for this stuff again in the last few months, I mean, I'm only seeing left doors, back doors, or, you know, like, you know, people selling the entire stuff. And this is going, like, like this might get me 80 bucks. But, obviously, I'm not going to part with it because I love it so much. Um, but, yeah, so it's been really hard to find a replacement door. So, I'm just going to keep looking. I have my eBay notifications set. Um, and, you know, again, if it only is just a thing that my kids play with, I'll be happy with that. And same for thing for this. Eventually, like, my kids are going to play with this. I, everything that I buy outside of this stuff these are the daddy toys um but outside of that i want to give up all this stuff is eventually going to go to my kids let's be perfectly honest right so um i gotta tell you if you're a fan of ghostbusters i know that there's literally nothing else that we can use with this figure or this this car but if you have the means and you're able to come across it, I think you, it's still available through the app. Like I said, there was like a handful, more than five at, at my target. Um, so if you have the funds and you're a fan of the, the, the franchise, this is really awesome. And I can only imagine if this is so great and the Plasma Series figures, even though I don't have them, are gorgeous. You have to assume that these little 375 three, guys that they're going to come out with are going to be perfect honestly like this is going to be an awesome toy line i am very excited and that's about it guys this is i'm this is going to be displayed this is going back to my kids this is it's just very cool it's very cool so that's it thank you for checking out my unboxing it's been a while since i got you know had the the ability the time to make one of these but it's always a blast and thank you for sharing your time i appreciate your support um Really, I appreciate your support. Thank you so much for you guys checking out this stuff and my collection and just my hobbies. So thank you. I mean, I mean that from the bottom of my heart. Thank you for uh, checking this stuff out. And I'll keep making it. 
<laughs> All right, guys. I'm Yimbo. Till next time.